Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to our channel. In this video, I'll be showing you how to get iOS screen recorder app on Android. Just like this. So make sure to watch till the end. And this is my original control center app on Oppo. So this time you need to download this application from the description below. So open the app, then set up application. So we are now applying an iOS control center to get the iOS screen recording feature on this app. So select continue and then apply now so make sure to turn on the eye center application first turn on notification access click allow and then turn on accessibility so there our iOS control center was set up now I suggest that you turn off your Wi-Fi to avoid add interruption while setting up the application now try to slide down from the left corner and you can see here the notification lock screen you may disable it if you want to or in case you just want to apply the iOS screen recording feature so you may turn off the notifications and this time let's customize our controls from our control center so you may add applications or rearrange these features in your own control center you can also add edge triggers to put some uh, watermark on which you will pull down the control center and this time you can also create your customized focus or do not disturb mode so here let's try to create a custom one select the color the icon and the name you want to apply in your um, sleep or focus mode and then customize the allowed applications to notify so here we have it and this time let's change the wallpaper and the theme of our control center you may select transparent or to set it naturally just select the current wallpaper now let's test it slide down from the right corner and as you can see here we can now control the um, volume and brightness settings using the control center but that's not our main point here now select that screen recording button click allow and wait for the timer and here we are now screen recording our screen using the iOS style screen recording app after this one it will be automatically saved in your videos 